I will now begin my presentation. Nowadays, athletes wear sensors that convey real-time information to a trainer's tablet. GPS accurately pinpoints motion. Smartphones keep everyone current and wearable tech can prevent injuries. Compared to whiteboards and post-practice reviews, technology has substantially increased athletic potential. The right tech can have a massive impact on an athlete's ability to perform and improve over time. It allows athletes to replicate different situations they might face during competition, become more informed about their recovery and take a data-driven approach when training. I to a greater extent agree that the use of technology in sports is fair. However, there are some disadvantages as well which I will highlight moving forward. The most compelling reason why I think that technology is a boon in sports as it helps the sportsmen enhance their performance. The use of virtual reality has allowed for athletes to be able to train using virtual scenarios and receive feedback almost instantaneously or immediately. This allows correcting the shortfalls and improving the performance before the competition significantly. Moreover, better medical care results in fewer injuries or faster recovery from injury. With the help of technology, the anatomy of the athletes is monitored such as heart rates, muscle strength, stamina and so on. Such data is further used in the training which enhances the overall health and helps in avoiding the injuries that may arise in the sports. So, the overall health of the athletes is also enhanced. Also, the use of technology increases confidence and trust in officials as the human errors are eliminated and a fair decision can be achieved during the course of the game. The prime example of fair play is the use of decision review system in the game of cricket. The DRS system gives an opportunity to both batsmen and bowlers to challenge the decision of the on-field empire. For viewers, the technology provides a better viewing experience. These days, the 360 degree view of the sporting arena is achieved with 3D camera and use of drones to capture and telecast live sporting events. This has enhanced the viewing experience of the viewers who are unable to travel to the stadiums to watch the sports competition. Such experience gives a feeling of watching the match same as watching it in the stadiums. On the other hand, the major disadvantage is the invades the privacy of the players. Collecting data about the athletes and storing it securely is one of the major concern in the sports fraternity. Moreover, the use of technology is not cheap, so to use it makes sports and success exclusive to wealthy people and countries. There are many poor countries who could not afford the expenses of using high-tech technology, thus they are under performance or even remain away from the competition. I feel that if these disadvantages are addressed, then technology will surely be very beneficial to not only the participant but also to the viewers of the sports all over the world. Thank you for your attention.